In this one, we're asked to simplify sine of 600 degrees. Okay, and we're going to be using our unit circle on this. And 600 degrees, we just have to remember that 600 can be kind of broken down, right? I mean, the, the unit circle is really good um, for measuring these, but the unit circle goes up to 360 degrees. So what this basically means is we're going to take our 360 degrees, and then we're going to add 240 degrees on top of that. So we're going to go all the way around once. Then we're going to go around an additional 240 degrees. Okay, so if I were to draw that, it would look like this, right? We're going to go all the way around the, way around the circle once. Then we're going to go all the way, not quite all, all the way around, but we're going to go right to 240 degrees, all right? So when we're looking at that, that is um, the point that we're looking for, right? 240 degrees there. And if we simplify it, remember that sine is all of our y values. So I go out right out here at this 240, and I go down here. My x value is negative 1 half. My y value is negative square root of 3 over 2. So remember, sine are all of my y values, so I simplify this one to simply be negative um, square root of 3 over 2.